2018-12 is the second quarterly simultaneous release. Here are some general and Git improvements of the Eclipse IDE, improvements that have been added since the September release. Eclipse 2018-12 now starts even a bit faster than Eclipse 2018-9. The 32-bit support has been dropped. No more Eclipse 32-bit for Windows and Linux. Control e brings up the Quick Switch Editor dialog which now shows, in addition, the path of the opened files. Please note, the path is not taken into account by the filter. In the File, Switch Workspace dialog, a new Content Assist makes it easy to enter the path of the workspace. If you hit Control Space, you can select the subfolder from a list. In Window, Preferences, General, Appearance, Colors and Fonts, you can for example type Bold to find bold fonts, or fonts that have the term bold in their description. You can also filter by font name. Or and by font size. The Git perspective has been redesigned. The splitting Git repositories view versus editor area and other views is now 3070 instead of 5050. And the history view instead of the properties view is shown initially. The file new menu contains Git repository to create a new Git repository. And the search menu consistently contains Git search. If something is selected in the Git repository's view, the status bar names the selected item instead of displaying one item selected. Multiple Git repositories can be selected to switch to same name branches at once. This also works when selecting multiple projects from different Git repositories. In Eclipse 2018-9, the UI was sluggish when selecting commits with thousands of changed files. Now, even with 10,000 files, there is almost no delay. Pull can be done on multiple repositories in parallel. To do this, increase the value here in the Git preferences. Apache Miner can be chosen as an alternative SSH client. In the future, Apache Miner will probably replace the old SSH client, as the old one is no longer developed as open source. More keywords are now recognized when filtering Git preferences. For instance, when entering stage, not only staging view, but also committing is displayed. In a git attributes file, setting end of line to native works as it should now. Also in git configurations, native is now recognized. The Git staging view follows also compare editors, as you can see here. In the right-click menu, Show in offers more targets to navigate to. For example, Show in Navigator or Show a state deleted file in the history. These were some of the general and Git improvements of the quarterly December rolling release 2018. Thank you for watching and happy coding!